1683. Techno Titan. And down on the end, 4910. East Cobb Robotics. Over here on the blue, leading it up, they're the ones in green. It's 832. Oscar. And in the middle, it's 1127. Lotus Robotics. Rounding out this blue alliance, it's 1311. Kel Robotics. All right, field is green. FTA is blue, here we go. Drivers behind the line, three, two, one, charge! And they're off once again into the world of autonomous. Look at 49-10, crash across the field into the back retaining wall of the arena. As the first 15 seconds of autonomous are complete, the humans now take control. Oscar is underway as Cal Robotics crosses across the moat, back and forth, back and forth, weakening that defense, no longer useful as 5482 crosses through the sally port. 4910 crosses across the Cheval de Freeze. Sir Lancebot now comes under the low bar and crosses or tries to cross across the Cheval de Freeze again. While 1683, the Techno Titans swam across the moat. 4910 jumps across the Cheval de Freeze. 1311 climbs across the rock wall into the center neutral zone. Oscar dancing around in the middle. 1311 trying to climb the wall. They successfully climb it and get into the courtyard for the Red Alliance. 5482 robotics at the rock wall, successfully jumping over the rock wall, weakening that defense. Now the Red Alliance has successfully breached all five defenses of the Blue Alliance. They're moving backwards and forwards, left and right, north to south, east to west. 60 seconds still to go in the match. A lot of action can take place as Kell swims across the moat. Oscar tries to maneuver across the Cheval to freeze, but ends up going under the low bar. As 5482 jumps across the rock wall one more time. Oscar successfully goes under the low bar as Kell successfully jumps over the Cheval to freeze. Now, 1311 and 832 with 30 seconds left to go into match are dancing in the Red Alliance courtyard. Three Red Alliance robots challenging the tower at this time with just under 20 seconds left to go. Oscar dancing around in the courtyard as 1311 approaches the Cheval de Freeze trying to weaken that one more with 11 seconds to go. If they can do that, if they can get successfully across, they'll weaken it down. They have. They're trying to challenge. They've got three seconds to go to get to the challenge. They run out of time at the last second. But we have three successful challenges by the Red Alliance. One successful challenge by the Blue. Each challenge worth five points apiece. We have a score for qualifying quest number 16. 77 for the Red Alliance. 64 for the Blue Alliance. There was one red penalty with five points awarded to the Blue Alliance. That did not make a difference in the score, but it can later on. Both alliances were credited with one ranking point for breaching the outer works defenses of each other's alliance.